Hey, good evening. Just want to show you what I picked up today at the card shop. Um, I went through the 50 cent box and I'll show you what I got. Pretty much picked up Junk Wax Era Hall of Famers plus some newer stuff. Pretty much all this is to add to my PC. And of course, not all of these people are Hall of Famers, but it's for my PC collection. Can't quite figure out which what this is from. Sorry, my sinuses are driving me nuts right now. We haven't had any moisture here quite a while so it's pretty dry I thought this one was a pretty cool card Some 89 upper deck cards. There's a 91 stadium club. Then he had this in the 50 cent box as well. It's from Bowman Draft, obviously. Since he was the uh, NL Rookie of the Year this year. This year's Heritage. And this one was in the baseball box. Um, people just kind of throw the cards back in, but I saw this one, and I remember the hype on this. It's got the Menendez brothers in it in the background there on the left right there. thought that was pretty cool. Obviously, the situation wasn't cool back then, but... Trying to finish my heritage set. I didn't have my list with me. I didn't know if I had this one, so I went ahead and picked it up. And obviously, I have it. This one's going to go out to somebody. And I had a few of these 3D tops cards. So I picked up this Cronenworth. There's a 
each row from 14 prison. Like I said, I picked up a hundred cards here. Got the silver pack, Ryan McMahon, rookie. I think he's still going to be a good player. I remember having this one when I was a kid. Because Joe Carter played here. He's well, he's kind of a local. Played on the Shockers World Series team. Six baseball boxes. Here's a silver pack prism. That'll probably go out to some makes. I think I've got a couple extras of those. I am collecting as much Iron Auto stuff right now as I can. This one is pretty cool. It's old Satchel Page from the Browns. shot Randy Johnson riding a fire truck when they won the World Series with the Diamondbacks 2013 prison This one was pretty cool. Remember watching Bo Jackson growing up? He's one of my favorites. I 
I dig these hologram cards. Now I didn't pay full price for these. He did cut me a deal. Well, 100 of them. Sounds like my son just got woke up. Hope it wasn't me. Mama won't care too much for that if it was me. Griffey and Bones. This one is pretty cool. I'm going to try to start collecting some more Campanella player era cards. He was a phenomenal athlete. A short, short career, unfortunately. Add to my Pete Rose collection. Stan the Man. One of my all time favorites. And the last card that I'm going to show you tonight. That's all I have for you. Keep on collecting. I'm still going through picking my YouTube channels for the Sports Cards Hall of Fame. Um, so I've still got another couple weeks got a lot of good channels out there it's hard to pick so keep on collecting and good evening